Good morning everybody, Orin J here with another Honkai Star Rail video, and today we're going to be answering a question I get all of the time, and that's, is it better to do single pulls or ten pulls? When should you do both? And believe it or not, there are actual answers to these questions. It's not just a do whatever feels right for you kind of thing. There is an answer for when you should single pull in this game, and it's more or less just always, but I do know that people are people, and always doing single pulls, I mean, look, if you're going deep in a banner, ain't nobody got time for that. So let me give you the breakdown of when you should do single pulls, when it matters, all of that. Let's jump into the banners, and we're going to end this video by pulling on this banner, because I got 13 tickets. This snuck up on me. I didn't realize I had 13 tickets, but we're going to do some pulls, because that's fun. And let's actually address the Stellar Warp first. Look, here's the deal with the Stellar Warp. Every time you get tickets, just go pull. It does not matter if you do 10 pulls or single pulls on this banner, because you just use them. You get no added benefit from clicking the Warp Time 10s button. In a lot of gacha games, clicking the Warp Times 10 button is the thing that guarantees you the like equivalent of a four star in this game. That's not how Honkai Star Rail works. You are just guaranteed a four star once out of every 10 pulls. You could do a one pull and then another pull and another pull, single, 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 and one time you will get it. Or you could do a 10 pull and you're guaranteed that one of those pulls out of that 10 is a four star, and then it just starts over. Essentially, every time you hit the four star, your count starts over, and before you get to 10 again, you'll get another one. Same thing with the five stars and the 90 pity. As soon as you pull a five star, your pity starts all the way over. It doesn't matter what button you click. Click either one, so just throw your tickets at the Stellar Warp whenever you want. It doesn't matter. That's the, that's the answer to that one. Now, when you get to the character event warp banners, it starts mattering a lot more because you probably have a goal when you get to the banner. Let me show you a mistake I made because I didn't understand this perfectly, and we're going to look at my last pull for Sela. I was pulling for E6 Sela, right? So let's look at my records right here and note that my last one, two, three, four, five, six, seven pulls were not her. I got her eight pulls ago. That means I am seven pulls closer to my next pity. I could have accidentally hit her again and gotten a dupe for a character that I had maxed. Essentially, the, think about it like this. The last time I was pulling, I only wanted one. Some people are going to go to like Jing Yuan's banner and only want one copy of him. If that's the case for you, you really only want to do single pulls. Because if you do a 10 pull and you get him on pull 2 of the 10, you are essentially wasting 8 pulls. Now look, I know pity carries over. Before I said this, there's probably 14 people in the comment section actively typing that pity carries over. But it doesn't mean it's equivalent. Like... It's better to have eight pulls on the next banner and then let that build up your pity because there's always a chance one of those eight pulls could hit the thing you're going for than it is to accidentally have eight pulls on the last banner and take the consolation prize of, well, at least my pity's carrying over. So that's when you need to be a little bit more... Um, you want to do singles is what I'm trying to say. Now, look, I do understand that not everybody has the patience of a god and is willing to do single pulls all the time. So we're going to go to the warp tracker real quick right here and talk about four star and five stars and look at when the soft pity is because there is a clear soft pity in this game and it starts at about pull 74 and goes to the end. If you get, if you just, if you're like, look, I want one copy of Jing Yuan and I'm just convinced that I'm not going to accidentally pull two copies before Soft Pity. If that's the route you want to take, that's fine. Throw 10 pulls at the banner. But once you get up near like pull 60 and pull 70, I would really slow down. And again, if your goal is only one, I would start going for single pulls as you approach the Soft Pity of, you know, 72. Maybe it set, maybe at pull 70, you back up off and just start dropping single pulls until you get your golden door and your Jin Yuan walks out. Now, what if you're just pulling for like a Ting Yun or one of the boosted four-star characters on Jing's banner or whoever's banner comes out next? You have about a 22% chance of hitting those every time you get a four-star. You're guaranteed a four-star in every 10 pull. So if you're just pulling for a four-star unit, even though your odds of pulling it are much better at nine or 10, you should only do single pulls. If your goal is only to get one copy of a single four-star unit, you should only single pull because there's a lot 
a lot of tin pulls that get double four stars. And if you pull Ting Yun or Su Shang, whichever your target is, in the first pull of that tin pull, you wasted nine. And I know pity carries over, so it's not fully wasted. And that's a really nice thing that the like development team is giving us here. But it's still not the same as saving those pulls and having them ready for the next banner so you could get the unit that you want while building up your pity. Okay, now, I want to do some pulls. Let's end this video with pulling. Here we go. All right, we got 13 tickets. I'm going to do a 10 pull because why not? In fact, my last two 10 pulls on this banner were both 5 stars. So my streak of 10 pulling 5 stars is over. I'm going to get a, a, a purple door. So I'll, I will go, you know, 4 star this thing. I want a copy of... Uh, I just want anything I don't have maxed. Honestly, anything I don't have maxed would be good. Especially a unit. March 7th, dupe of March 7th. I'll probably have her about maxed out after Jing Yuan's banner. Yeah, if I'm being real about it. But there we go. There's the four star. So now, sometime in between now and my next 10, I'm guaranteed another four star. There we go. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, I have three tickets left. If I had four more pulls, I would guarantee myself one more four star. Let's just see if we can get it with these three. Because the highest percent chance, according to the poll tracker, was on poll nine. I will get there on my third ticket. Okay, blue door right there. We'll skip that one. Some three star card. Single pull again. We're just looking for a purple door. Or a gold... Yeah, I'd take a rainbow ticket gold door. That would be sweet. Oh my gosh. I would... You know how much I'd love a Branya? You guys know how much I would love to have a Branya coming at me right here? Okay, that's nothing. One more ticket. Come on, baby. Hit me with the Branya! Nope. Okay, maybe. Now, soft pity's about now for a four star. So there's a really good chance this is a purple door. Uh, yep, there it is. Did not have to go to my 10th. Got it in 9, so saved a pull. And got shared feelings. Okay, so a 4-star light cone. I'll take that. That's not too bad. I'm really tempted to just click this button right here and drop about 1,600 Cellar Jade for a 10 pull, but I'm not going to do it because Jing Yuan's banner comes out in literally like one day. So I'm going to save my, my jade for that. Thank you all for watching. I hope this video answered the question. The TLDR is you should just basically always single pull if you want to be most efficient. If you don't care about being most efficient, do 10 pulls till you approach soft pity, which on a character banner is about pull 70. Then go to singles so you're not wasting pulls. Or, honestly, if you're pulling and you're going for like E6, 10 pull to your heart's content because you ain't pulling all 6 in one 10 pull. You don't even have to worry about it at that point. Alright, thank you guys for watching. Have a great day and I'll catch you next time. Peace.